Okay, in this video we're, we're told that the weekly cost C, and the way they phrase this is always pretty much the same, is that this C is now representing cost. They pair those up. And we're told that the cost of a manufacturing X amounts of, or some amount of remote controls, is given by this formula. In other words, if you want to know how many, what the cost has been of a certain amount of remote controls, you can use this formula. And again, cost C, we're looking at dollars. So we want to know what's the cost of producing 1,000 remote controls. Well, that means that X is 1,000 because X represents the remote controls or the number of remote controls. Here, with 2,000 remote controls, X is 2,000. And here, with 2,500, X is 2,500. And now, really, this becomes the same problem as we've been doing, which is to plug these numbers in to this formula. So for part A, we're going to get the cost as being 2,000 plus 3 times 1,000. And that's just 2,000 plus 3,000, or $5,000. And you could write you know, the dollar sign here, 5,000. And then in part B, again, C equals 2,000. This time it's plus 3 times 2,000. And that's, well, 2,000 plus 6,000, or 11,000. And then we could write our answer as $11,000. And then part C, well, now X is 2,500. So C equals 2,000 plus 3 times 2,500. That's equal to 2,000 plus 7,500, or 9,500. Something wrong here. Oh, sorry, going back. This is, I, I noticed something wrong, by the way, because here I have more remote controls than before, and somehow it cost less. That, that can't make sense. So this, this last one's right, but let me fix this one up here. This is 2,000 plus... I, I must have thought it was 3 times 3,000, 3 times 2,000 or 6,000, that's 8,000. So this one should be 8,000. Alright, thanks.